A 24-year-old Philip Anderson is recovering at the hospital after police say his attempt at armed robbery backfired. Through the window of a white Monte Carlo, you can see an AK-47 assault rifle lying across the seat, just inches from a child's car seat. Dayton police say it was this powerful weapon that set off a dangerous situation. Officers say 24-year-old Philip Anderson was driving the Monte Carlo on Brooklyn Avenue just after 5 tonight when he cut off another driver, a 72-year-old man. But police say Anderson wasn't done with his victim. The 24-year-old stepped out of the, his vehicle with a AK-47 type assault rifle and pointed it at the 72-year-old man and said, give me all you got. Officers say instead of money, Anderson got bullets. Little did this kid know that the 72-year-old man was a licensed CCW carrier and he produced his own firearm and defended himself because he was in fear of his life and shot the would-be robber twice. Anderson was hit once in the abdomen and once in the left arm. A couple of bullets missed, hitting a neighbor's car and a house, putting the entire neighborhood in danger. This sad. I mean, this 24-year-old punk thought he can rule the world with this AK-47 and it endangered a lot of people that are out here, including some young kids who actually witnessed the event as it happened and their lives could have been in danger as well. Well, I'm told Anderson's injuries are not life-threatening, although when he's released from the hospital, he will face charges of aggravated robbery. The shooter will not face any charges.